Looking to tackle a new project around your home this year? Over the next 30 minutes, North Central Wisconsin's home improvement experts will share ways you can spruce up your home's interior, exterior, and everything in between. This is the Home Enhancement Show. Move your party outdoors with a space that's great for cooking and entertaining. Shallows Nursery reveals how you can build the perfect outdoor kitchen that's not only fun, but beneficial to the value of your home. My boss, Gordy Shallow, he'll come in and measure up and see what the people want and what kind of uh, materials that they want to use. And then he'll design and, you know, there's always a dollar, well, how much they want to spend on it, and what they want to do. And sometimes we'll go to a job and we'll do partial, we'll do one partial year, we'll do some. And then, you know, we'll go on the next year because, you know, it's a little bit too much expensive to do it or whatever you know, in little, um, but that's usually how they do it. He'll get what they want and what they need, and then he'll draw a design, and then he'll show it to them, and he'll show them all the materials that are options and what they like and what they don't like, and colors, and there's just so many options to go with. Oh, pizza ovens, you can buy them gas or you can buy them wood, and you can make them look like anything you want from stucco to stone to brick. You can build these outdoor kitchens out of the stone or you can, there's block, you can build them out of the block. You, it's just all kinds of options. You can put grills, you can see there's a side burner to this one, you know, wine refrigeration, regular refrigerators, just anything you want to do. The grills are okay. There's certain um, countertops that have to be undercover and some that don't. Granite, there's certain granite ones that are better in the weather and other kinds of granite that aren't. Some of them don't like the leaves on them and they kind of will stain them and stuff like that. Concrete too can kind of be the same as that. Uh, there's uh, land and stone that you can use for them and that looks really nice too. Um, but you know, it's just with the grills and stuff, it's just keeping them clean refrigerators, you gotta unplug them for the winter, and sometimes you can take them out and store them, but they can stay outside. This is the stone that's on the building. That's why we use this stone. And that's sometimes what we do with clients is, if they got like the cultured stone on their house, we'll match it and try to match the mortar and stuff. But if there isn't any, we can also build it out of like uniform, universal blocks, or we've used like uh, metal, on it, you know, like metal to go around it and stuff like that. And uh, uh, there's another one too where you stack the blocks up on it, they hang on like a frame, and they're really neat. There's just all kinds of options. Just depends what the people like, you know. We will install the appliances, but then usually we gotta have like uh, a gas company or something come in and run all the gas lines and the electrical company and run the electrical lines in it. But we'll work with them to make sure we got everything where it's gotta be for them when they come to install that stuff. But we actually buy the grills and stuff and install them. People are starting to have a little bit more fun in their outdoors and staying home a little bit more and grill out and cook. And some people have a TV out there so they can watch Packer games or Badger games, you know, and sit out and enjoy it and have fun cooking on the grill while the kids are playing in the yard, you know, and, and, and it's a good investment because it brings value to your house and, you know, just your family values. Stop by Shallows Nursery in Marshfield for all of your landscaping and gardening needs. In Wisconsin, our outdoor furniture can take a beating. Stony Creek Home and Garden detail the best way to care for your outdoor furniture and what you should look for if you're considering an upgrade. I'm Erica Peterson from Stony Creek Home and Garden in Monaco, Wisconsin. And we are here today to talk about outdoor and patio furniture since the summer season's coming up on us pretty quickly. And I'm sure at this point, everybody's sick of being cooped up inside. So when people come in looking to spruce up their backyard, we offer a wide variety of things such as outdoor and patio furniture, we have a great selection of fire tables, 
We've got hammocks, umbrellas for the shade. Um, if you're looking to add some greenery, we also have a great selection of pottery, plants, all sorts of things that you can use to in get outside and enjoy your backyard this summer. There are a variety of materials that are meant to be outside. Um, anything from the recycled plastic lines to all-weather wicker, um, there's wood collections, there's teak, there's e-pay. There's also metal, there are cushions, There are, you can get things without cushions. All of the furniture collections that we carry that have cushions are outdoor cushions, meaning they are weather resistant, water resistant, they don't fade from the sun, they'll, they'll last for quite a few years. And if you have furniture that's getting old and the cushions are worn down, we can definitely help you with replacing those. So we can help you create um, the perfect layout for your furniture outside on your patio, on your screen porch. We really try to find out what, what their best use of the space is. Are they looking for a cozy, comfortable space with some love seats, a couch that they can lay down on? Um, do they want two chairs that they can, you know, a couple might be able to sit in and have a place to enjoy their coffee in the morning. Do you have a large family? Do you want multiple sofas and love seats? Do you want a sectional? Just kind of trying to create that space for your friends and family. So we carry a wide variety of furniture, um, price points, groupings. We have the high-end furniture that will last you a lifetime. We have middle of the road furniture and then we also are starting to get into some new lines that might be a little bit more affordable for your average new family who's starting out that just wants to get outside, enjoy it, um, but they don't want a huge investment. So if you stop in and you don't see what you're looking for, please make sure and ask us. Um, we are working on our website, getting it updated just to show the variety of items. One of the big questions we have from people is can this really go outside? And yes, it really can go outside. Um, one of the brands that we've carried forever, Lloyd Flanders, is made in Menominee, Michigan. It has been around forever, and they truly do understand snow, they understand winter. A lot of times we have people coming in after 20, 30 years, and they need new cushions because the frame of the furniture is great, but the cushion just over time has been worn out. So really, it, everything we do have really can go directly outside. We are a locally family-owned, business and have been from the beginning. We strive to make sure that your outdoor space is as enjoyable as it can be. At Stony Creek, we are dedicated to working with you to create the best outdoor living experience possible. For help designing your outdoor living space, visit Stony Creek Home and Garden in Minocqua. Garage door openers are smarter than ever. Zabel's Door Company highlights the safety and security features in two of the latest garage door openers and explains why you should consider an upgrade. Hi, this is Dan from Zabel Door Company. Zabel Door Company is a locally owned and operated business since 1996. We specialize in all your overhead door needs, whether it be residential, commercial, we do it all, sales and service. Today we will be showcasing two of LiftMaster's newest operators and the safety and security features that go along with them. One of the operators today we will be talking about is the model 85503. It's a DC battery backup belt drive operator. Comes capable with Wi-Fi uh, to connect to MyQ technology where you can run it from your smartphone. Some of the safety features on the camera would be a night vision and a glare resistant lens, letting you see at all times of day. So with the 360 degree camera, you can manually move it wherever you would like it to be. All you gotta do is spin it. It has a 140 degree wide angle. It also has two-way audio that comes out of it. You can talk through your smartphone now that you can see your camera itself. And now from this area here, you can take, you can unmute the camera. So any noise in the garage itself, you can listen to at that point. And from here as well, you can also just take a picture and it automatically saves it to your photos. With the camera that's on these new operators, you can also get into the video storage uh, through that MyQ technology app. Uh, with the LiftMaster operator that has the built-in camera, 
There's also other safety features like a posi lock system, timer to close, and of course the photo eye system that goes along with just about every operator nowadays. Uh, the posi lock system though is something that's pretty unique. It electronically stops the door itself from somebody being able to pry it open and force past the motor. It does not allow that. It'll re-engage and push the door back down, making it harder for anybody to get in. And our second operator today that we'll be talking about is the WLED operator. It's also a DC battery backup with the belt drive. With the WLED operator though, it has way brighter LED lights that go along with it. There's 3100 lumens that come out of this operator. Corner to corner lighting. So if you have poor lighting in your garage, uh, this is a simple way to do that, to fix that problem. With that being said, there is a motion detector on the wall button itself, where if it does detect motion, the lights on the operator do come on. Also with the WLED light, it is capable to add on a camera itself. So if you like the camera option from the operator before, but wanted the extra lights, you can easily add that on to this system. Uh, this is super easily adjustable. Uh, just one little plug that does get plugged into an outlet. It doesn't actually get plugged into the operator itself. There is battery backup with these operators as well. Um, so if there is ever a power outage, you will get at least 30 cycles with that battery. There is also a automatic garage door lock that is actually capable with both operators we're talking about today. These are just a few of the options for LiftMaster that we offer. We have a large inventory of many models to choose from, all of them having similar safety features with MyQ technology to keep your peace of mind. For added safety, I would recommend either of the two operators we talked about today. And remember, don't get mad, calls the bells. Whether you're having issues with your garage door or it's just time for an upgrade, call, click, or visit Zabell's Door Company in Merrill. Are chipped, stained, or damaged floors hurting your home's curb appeal? Wisconsin Coating Specialists describe the various ways they can upgrade your concrete flooring, plus how you can maximize the space in your garage or work area. My name is Rachel with Wisconsin Coating Specialists. Some of you formerly knew us as Zone Garage Wisconsin. Several things have changed with our business, but one thing has remained the same. We are a family-owned and operated business located in Marathon County, Wisconsin. When you come to our showroom, you'll be able to visually see the floors, different countertop options. You'll be able to see exterior surfaces, as well as a full line of C-Tech cabinetry. Our main flooring that we offer would be our granite style flooring. That is our most economical floor. That floor can be installed inside, outside. We can do full staircases. We can cover wood. We can cover concrete. It's antibacterial, mold resistant easy to clean, easy to maintain. Another floor that we offer, which is becoming more and more popular, is the metallic systems. So we offer beautiful metallic floors. Those are the ones that are going to have the metal pigments within them. They swirl, they change color and light. Some of them have different depth dimensions. Those would also be available in a countertop option. One application that our flooring has become more and more popular in is going to be the Schaus or the Grouse aka the shop house or the garage house. Many people are building their homes on one solid continuous slab. By that, they're putting in hydronic heat. Our products work well with hydronic heat. They help make spaces warmer, tighter, cleaner. When we talk about a shouse or a grouse, we can come in and coat the entire surface. We've done entire homes, entire cottages, entire cabins, whether it be the house, is the metallic application, the garage, being the granite style, maybe a laundry room. Whatever it may be, we can come in and help with it. So many of us have a front porch that maybe has some stains or is a little unsightly. Maybe you have an old concrete patio that you're looking to enhance or brighten or refresh. Maybe there's a little bit of a crack in it, something that needs to be maintained. Tearing that whole slab of concrete out is a lot of work and a lot of expense. We have products available to coat those, to maintain them, to beautify them, to let you still be able to use the products. We've done many front porches, sidewalks. With Stone Wrap, which is our latest product that we brought in last spring, this is a product that at the end result looks like exposed aggregate. 
We lay this over, directly over a concrete surface. We come in, we do our prep. It takes outside, it's UV resistant. Again, mold, bacteria resistant products you can spray off with a hose and clean and have available to you for years to come. To support our local fire departments when we do their floors, we provide them with a logo of their choice. Whether it be a shield of their department or a specific created logo as a remembrance, we provide that, install that into the floor. We've also put logos into the floor in several kennels. When we talk about kennel spaces or veterinarian clinics, which we have worked with both, those areas need to be sanitary. We not only do the floors, but we've gone six, seven feet up walls, creating a seamless space where they can come in, hose everything down, disinfect, keep everything sanitary. Check us out on wisconsincoatingspecialists.com or feel free to come down to our showroom. Wisconsin Coating Specialist, tough and beautiful. Please visit online or call for your free estimate. Considering an upgrade to your cabinets or countertops? Featherstone Cabinetry and Design make it easy. Learn how their designers will work with you to create your dream look. Well, what we really strive for at Featherstone is to make the, the buying experience for the client to be uh, carefree, um, non-stressful type of situation. Uh, so often um, clients come in and they're, they're worried about um, worried about a lot of things and, and, and potentially they're expending a lot of money on their project and they're, they're worried about whether they can trust their vendors, trust their suppliers, things of that nature. So um, we have a staff of experienced designers and engineers and craftsmen here at this facility and um, we try to, to make that buying experience as stress-free as possible for them. You know, we, we usually start out by trying to, to find the focus or the scope of the project and um, just kind of work off of, off of things from there. Um, we, we look at a variety of things. We want to see what the end result is that they're looking to achieve um, and, and very much so to, to complete that and achieve that within their budget. And, um, Budget is always a factor for people, rarely it is, is it not, and um, we have multiple product lines that in, in cabinetry as well as countertops and, and related services that, that hopefully will, will meet their budget then. We will really walk you through the different construction styles and, and what they mean um, aesthetically as well as functionality, you know, functionally. Um, our designers will walk, walk the client through sorting those things out then. How can they integrate into their specific space? Um, how, how do those things integrate into their budget? You know, they may pick out something online that they're in love with, but find out it's completely out of their budget. Well then, we find that out and move on from there. Well, we offer a wide variety of uh, different countertop materials, um, from quartz to granite to solid surface. Um, Decton is another type of material and also uh, laminate. But all of these materials are quality materials. It really just depends upon your budget as well as what you're trying to achieve on your project. Project coordination is something that really comes kind of naturally to, to our, our, our business. Um, you know, oftentimes there's electrical changes, there's plumbing changes. Um, a lot of times there's tile involved um, or flooring. Um, and, and we've we've built a team of people over a period of years that we trust that have the same values we do as a company that we can confidently recommend to our clients to say hey this business is someone that you're going to want to partner with and they'll take care of you and, and I think that that um, the ability to have that team of people is, is really something that helps us be very successful. We really feel that you know our job here is to, is to pre present information and, and the associated costs with, with different, different specifications, different designs, different looks, and really let the client decide whether or not that's for them or not, and um, whether it meets their, their aesthetics and their function, as well as their budget. And really, we're just the presenters of that information, and it's really up to the client to make an intelligent buying decision. And that's really what we feel our job is, is to present that information to them so that they're educated, on, on these things and they can make a, a smart choice that, that they're happy with in the end. Call, click, or visit Featherstone Cabinetry and Design for a free consultation.
Improve the beauty and value of your home's interior and exterior. King Quarry explains how it can be done with the use of real stone and breaks down the different types of stone available. King Quarry cuts stone for interior fireplaces, exterior walls, interior walls. We cut patio stone. Uh, we also have one of the largest stocking landscape stone yards in northern Wisconsin. Our sources are you know, all over North America, you know, Canada, out west, uh, down south. Sandstone, limestone, granite, gneiss, gabbro, field stones, split face. Uh, we're able to do all kinds of stuff. So this stone here, we call black and tan for obvious reasons. Uh, heavy in black colors and heavy in the brown and tan colors. Uh, this is actually a Wisconsin stone. It, it happened to be one of our more popular products. Uh, on this project, the customer wanted a random ashlar. And by random ashlar, uh, I mean random heights. Every stone here is not a, a predetermined height. It, it just goes through the saw and however it comes out, whatever height is, is what it is. It, it can be cut also into specific heights, which would be your sawn height ashlar. But in this case, it's a random ashlar. The owner chose to have go with joints in here, mortar joints. Uh, but it, also a very popular look is a style like this. This is also another uh, deep charcoal stone in a stacked look, uh, which gives it more of the old fashioned uh, stack style that they used to do back in the days of building barns by hand and whatnot. Uh, so there's so many options as to how you can lay up a particular stone. The man-made stone uh, made out of concrete, it's got generally a painted finish on it. With real stone, it's kind of like a snowflake or, or a fingerprint, and you'll never find two of the same. Whereas your man-made stones, everything comes from molds, everything, uh, you'll see a repeating pattern after a while. On big projects especially, you'll be able to look at a wall, pick out a stone, and if you stare at that wall long enough, you'll find another rock on that wall that looks identical. Uh, might be painted a different color, but it's an identical stone just because they're simply coming from molds. In most cases, it comes to us bulk, so we'll, we'll have it come in to us full stone, usually blasted right out of the quarries. We'll bring it in by the truckload, and then we'll run it through our saw and saw it into a thin veneer, which is inch and a quarter plus or minus. Or a lot of times, mason homeowners would like a thick veneer uh, just to give that more true full stone look. So a lot of times, the customer put it on it a two and a half inch veneer. With a two and a half inch veneer, the mason can tuck the joints back further and it truly looks like a full stone. We do lots of custom sawing for customers. In fact, that's one of the things we take pride in. Uh, we're not just set on you know, 30 or 50 standard styles. And although we do have them always available, many times customers will bring in a, a photo that they find in a magazine or a photo they find online and they'll say, hey, you know, can you match a stone or can you get something close? With our uh, abundant quarry sources from all over North America, really, we're able to put together uh, the types and colors and styles of stone that they're looking for and come up with these custom blends for them. Uh, we do have a double-sided 360 foot, eight foot high live display wall outside of our uh, saw facilities. Uh, people are welcome to come there and look at we probably have 50 stone styles on that wall. People are welcome to walk around and look at it anytime, even uh, when we're closed, that's not a problem. Make your next project a project of distinction. Contact King Quarry today for a free quote. From major weather events to widespread outages, there are a number of things that can cause your home to experience power failure. Christopher Electric breaks down the advantages of using a backup generator. Christopher Electric, uh, we're specializing in standby generation, uh, backup power for the last five years exclusively. Prior to that, uh, we were doing some other uh, electric work. Uh, but now we are solely focused on backup power, standby power generation. Everyone has their own reason for uh, deciding to put it in a standby generator. Uh, commonly, uh, you'd be looking at sump pump uh, backup uh, to, to ensure that your basement stays dry. Uh, make sure your furnace stays running. Kind of protecting the, the assets of your home and the, the, the contents inside your home. Uh, secondly, it would be just for security. Uh, you know, if you uh, have a power outage in your, your home alone or just home in the dark, 
with a standby generator, you're able to cook, clean, uh, do all the things that you can do uh, when you have utility power, uh, and it doesn't disrupt your day-to-day -day life. Uh, if you depend on, uh, let's say, the internet for connectivity with work or family, it allows you to maintain that uh, electrical you know, uh, connection. So basically we do installations all year round. Uh, winter time is a little bit more challenging, but we do have ground thaw blankets that allow us to uh, level out the ground. We, we put down a, a preformed concrete pad typically, uh, then we set the generator on top. All of our gas and electrical connections will be uh, in the back of the unit. Uh, these units can be installed 18 inches away from the home as long as we, we meet some other uh, guidelines, uh, such as you know, five feet from an opening, things like that, uh, which do allow us to, to install year-round. Uh, installations such as this where we're out uh, away from the home farther, th this would probably need to wait until uh, uh, the ground is thawed and it'll allow us to dig in the gas and electric lines to the back. All these units outside do need gas and electric connections ran to them. Uh, e you know, either from your propane tank or from your natural gas source, and obviously from the transfer switch wherever that is located. But we have everything set up right here. This is uh, the power plant, the engine generator is attached to it, and uh, all in a nice weatherproof aluminum enclosure. Uh, again, once it's installed and set up here, no, no one really has to, to do anything uh, with it if they, if they don't want to. Uh, if they want us to come do the maintenance, we'll, we'll happily come take care of that for them. There are people that will uh, purchase these at box stores or online and then just hire uh, someone to do it for them or they'll attempt to do a, a self-installation. And uh, th really that's uh, not only dangerous in, the, in that if you don't uh, connect it correctly, uh, there's many problems with electric and, and uh, natural gas or propane, whatever your fuel source is that could arise. Uh, but going back to the, uh, the warranty aspect, if, if it's not installed 100% uh, correctly following all codes, uh, the, the manufacturers are not going to warranty their product. Um, and uh, being an outdoor standby generator uh, location is important. Uh, these will emit carbon monoxide, uh, which could put, lead to other potential harms in your home if it's improperly installed. For help with all of your electrical needs, turn to Christopher Electric. Call for your free home consultation today. Thanks for watching The Home Enhancement Show. Good luck with your home improvement efforts in 2020. Thank you to our sponsors, Shallows Nursery, Stony Creek Home and Garden, Zabel's Door Company, Wisconsin Coating Specialist, Featherstone Cabinetry and Design, King Quarry, and Christopher Electric.